Viper turbojet provides the power plant, one of the most successful British jet engine designs of all time. The Mark III also introduced ejector seats, strengthened wings and the wingtip mounted fuel tanks you can see on this one to give it slightly longer range. And it came into service with number two flying training school at Syaston in 1959. And the first all jet training course on the Mark III graduated the following year. This is a T3A. The avionics were upgraded on this compared with the standard Mark III and these started to be used for the training of direct entry pilots. Which means a direct entrant from school, doesn't indeed it? Indeed it does, yes indeed. Now you mentioned the engine, the um, Viper, uh, of course that engine has an interesting